Hey guys, welcome back to another brand new video on our gaming and today, I don't know if you guys have seen, but recently Logan Paul has come out and said that he can beat Mayweather in a fight. And I don't know about you guys, but I personally think this is insane and absolutely ludicrous. So we're going to unpack this video today. And for those of you interested, I will be giving my opinions on everyone mentioned in this video at the end. So don't forget to stick around and let's get into it. Tell you, let me tell you this. If I oh, caught Floyd video. in a real fight, what's up, what's up? Yeah. If I caught Floyd in a real fight, street fight, right. whoop his ass. All right. No question. Okay, you know what? Street fight, fair enough. Now hear me out, although I think he wouldn't have that much of a chance, there are no rules, which means he can punch him around the back of the head the same way he did to KSI, and he won't need to contest it with the judges this time. You got like MMA, octagon, whoop his ass. Okay. No question. Once again, Chief, still don't know about MMA. Like, I know he can't really use his legs to kick, but I don't think you can either, Logan. Please don't forget you're not a real boxer. You're a guy who makes dumb videos on YouTube and makes severe lapses of judgment. Jesus, that was a bit of a low blow. See what I did there? All right. The only place I think Floyd is safe, obviously the boxing ring, but to be honest, I don't give a fuck. Okay. I don't give a fuck. I would fight Floyd anytime, anywhere, okay. any place. Doesn't fucking matter to me. If I caught him, if I caught Floyd with one punch, one punch, uh -huh. I would snap this fucker in half. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he thinks he can snap someone in half with one punch despite only having done two boxing matches. Mayweather has been boxing since 1996 and is undefeated. Don't get me wrong, I'm not the biggest Mayweather fan. I do think he's a bit of a fake fire since he jabs and runs, but the fact still remains. I don't know, Logan keeps going on about his freakishly strong nature, but mate, I've never seen it displayed anywhere, not even in the KSI fights. Oh, crack, yeah. my friend. Oh. Fletcher, you know me. I'm eight inches taller. Yeah. I'm 40 pounds heavier. Yeah. I'm half his age. Yeah. I'm two times as hungry and 10 times as smart. He had me up until he said he was smarter. Like all the things he was saying earlier were facts, but that just, no. Logan, you haven't won a boxing match, never. And you're trying to argue that you have more fighting IQ than a man who has won 50 fights. Wow, my friend, I'm like used that. to beating up people weaker and shorter than me. I know. Bro, I grew up with Jake. Dude, I grew up with Jake. I know. I, know. I, I know. love I Jake. Bro, I, <laughs> I didn't even get paid to beat up Jake. He Weird flex, but okay. Not exactly that amazing that he's beat up Jake, but he's still doing God's work. But still, Jake's not a real boxer either. He's just a dollar store version of Logan, but more boring and irrelevant. You're in the real boxing the man now. There? Yeah, jeez. Oh, Let me sign it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Drop it. Shit, what is your oh my God, kids in America actually get him to sign a boxing glove. As if he's done something amazing for the world of boxing. You know what? No wonder he thinks he's some next level boxer that can beat up Mayweather. When you've got kids like this fueling his ego. Right, so whilst we're still speaking in the world of YouTube and boxing, Remember the guy who emerged victorious representing the UK in a fight against Logan? Yeah, well apparently he's just as delusional since he thinks he can beat Mike Tyson. Like, yeah. what about, okay, Mike Tyson. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, like people are like, Oh, oh, mate. Don't say you can beat Mike Tyson. Do not. I, no, I actually could, could, though. I actually could. Oh, no, 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 You are no, 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 yeah, JJ, you're undefeated having had three fights, one of which you drew, and you want a split decision. Pipe down, you only want a split decision. How has his ego managed to stay inside of his head? Wait, actually, his forehead is massive, so it makes sense. Never mind. Also, Joe Weller couldn't beat you, a guy who choked at the fight, and neither could Logan Paul, who isn't that great anyway. But still, these aren't things you should be allowed to flex, Mr. KSI. No one has beaten me, okay? All right, JJ, JJ, JJ. Do you, now. Think, do you think that there is a chance Mike Tyson and Logan Paul would draw? Um, I think Logan would beat Mike Tyson. I'm sorry, what? In what world could Logan Paul, a man who shares DNA with the guy who made It's Everyday Bro, ever be a Goliath like Mike Tyson? So, who do you think will win, Logan or Mayweather? Mayweather. Is that like easily. You're just saying because he slip so well. No, just because he's speed and te technical skill. Just stop talking about things like you know what you're on about. Anyone can put words together and make it sound somewhat educated. Saying the words like technicality doesn't mean you're smart. Like even I could have a crack at that and I'm not Einstein. The technicality and speed involved with Mike Tyson's punch could beat the velocity of Logan Paul's depending on the infrastructure of the ring and the positioning of their feet. It looks it's fast just... recently, still. 
But the thing is, it's Mike Mayweather Tyson. wouldn't it's Mike fight Tyson. Logan. It's Doesn't matter, Mike just hit anyone. Logan's too heavy. Nah. Logan's way too heavy. <laughs> All right. Even the rest of his side pieces are telling him he's wrong. I don't know how he hasn't accepted that yet. But later on, Mr. KSI, the man himself, went onto the radio to talk about his claims that he made in the last clip. So here it is. KSI, did you or did you not say that you could beat Mike Tyson? I repeat, former heavyweight champion of the world, Mike Tyson, probably one of the best boxers of our lifetime at a boxing match. Okay, so look, <laughs> this is what I think, all right? I don't think I would beat Mike Tyson. <laughs> he's backtracked he's fully just backtracked that's not what you were saying in the other video he seems pretty confident in that one okay but i think i could give it a fair shot obviously my man's 50 something i'm 27 okay i will go in there having to survive three four rounds it's like i just need to survive <laughs> but by then he's gonna be running out of steam oh he's 50 something he's gonna be slow he's gonna be like trying to chase me and be like oh man i'm there like jab Run the jab. <laughs> yeah, but I tell you, you'd even survive three to four rounds. Even though he's 50, one Mike Tyson punch will send you straight back into your La Lamborghini to drive you straight back to the hospital. For those of you that are wondering, here are clips of Mike Tyson training at the age of 53. These were taken this year. And you're trying to tell me that this... ...can survive three to four rounds of that. Uh, he's a legend. I don't actually want to buy him. That's long. Like, having to train for my Tyson. Like, I've seen the videos. Even at his age, like, now, it's mad. So... <laughs> well, he's 54, right? I heard yeah. you got to respect your elders. So you're just going to have to go with a run, jab, run, I reckon. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. I, I think so. I won't even get to use my right hand. Was it just one of those <laughs> things that you just said? I went, oh, I should have said that. I should, I should have said that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Immediately regret this decision. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, so it seems that he's understood that he's messed up here and he's backtracking and whatever, which is, I guess, fair enough. I mean, if I threatened Mike Tyson, I would also probably want to retract as well. Feel a bit threatened, to be honest. And I know a lot of the individuals and topics raised within this video do cause a lot of opinion. And considering the fight between Logan Paul and Mayweather might actually happen, here are my opinions. Before all of you 12 year olds in tracksuits come at me, I don't actually hate KSI and the Sidemen. I'm sorry I don't actually rep their merch and I don't want to ever wear YouTuber merch ever. Not even Big Boy Memeless, because if I do, I feel like I've lost my life. But in all honesty, I do respect and admire what KSI has done for the world of YouTube and converging it into, I guess, mainstream media. The Sidemen are pretty good. I don't hate all of them and I don't really like all of them either. I mean, Harry's probably the best one, no cap. And I actually do like Logan Paul, kind of, even though he's fucked up in the past, but he's changed a lot. I think Mike is a big influence on that and I do really like Mike, so. And also he's nowhere near as bad as Jake. I'm sorry, but Jake is probably missing a chromosome. But as far as boxing goes, Mike Tyson would still beat any of them any day. Mayweather's not a real boxer because he's absolute shite and doesn't actually box toe to toe. And if Logan was to ever fight Mayweather, I'm not sure if Mayweather would actually lose. I'm pretty sure he'd win as much as I hate to say it. And if Mike Tyson ever fought KSI, well, do I even need to say it? Mike Tyson would obviously beat his ass. But that wraps it up for today's video, guys. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe for more content if you did enjoy this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. No one has beaten me, okay? All right, JJ, JJ, JJ. Fight it out.